for the general uh, international guideline, almost of the uh, gastrointestinal association worldwide recommended to start the colon cancer screening for average risk. I mean, the patient who has no risk at all, about 50 years old. But recently, last year, uh, two years ago, the, the American Cancer of uh, Association of Oncology recommended a little bit earlier to start about 45. Uh, there are a little bit change on the data recently. When we recommend about uh, 45 to 50, that's because the more than 97% of the patient with colonic cancer will be diagnosed when they are more than 45 or 50 years. And the reason that we recommend a little bit earlier screening because recently we find that the patient who has colon cancer when aged below 40, before it's about 1% only and recently it's about 3%. It seems to be a small number from, I mean, 3% out of 100, but actually it's three times increase in the patient who is young. So right now it seems that the earlier screening could be more benefit to the patient. Actually, the, the, the incidence seems to be a little bit increased, especially when they start to have a program screening. The good thing is when we do the first five to 10 years of screening, the incidence of the colon cancer is going to be increased quite uh, dramatically because you look for the cancer. You don't wait for the, the patients to come. But the good thing is even though the incidence of the cancer is going to be increasing, but the, uh, the prognosis of the treatment is going to be much better also. Uh, yes, if you have family history or you have other specific risks of the uh, colon cancer factors, risk, you have to do it 5 to 10 years earlier than the standard recommendation, which means 40, 45, something like that. Mm -hmm.